Breaking news now just outside of Green Valley, south of Tucson. Evacuations underway as a wildfire continues to grow, threatening multiple structures. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Kevin Bouton. And I'm Valerie Cavazos. Crews have been working since noon to beat back the flames, the edge less than 10 miles from I-19. KGAN 9's Max Darrow is live at the scene. Max, what's it like out there? Oh, Kevin and Val, we can see the smoke from Valencia Road up in Tucson. You can see just a big cloud behind me as well. Now wind shifting all around. You see that's just blowing all around right here. Take a look, though. This is the video to show you a little closer look at the flames. And what you're seeing is burnout operations. They're trying to contain the fire and stop it from spreading. Uh, they're burning the brush quickly on the perimeter of the wildfire itself. A Green Valley fire official told me dealing with wind and low humidity are their biggest challenges right now and today, right now, is one of the most dangerous times to be fighting a fire. I'm told five structures are at risk. At least 10 people have been evacuated. Green Valley working alongside six other fire agencies today. LT Pratt of the Green Valley Fire Department says at this time of year, all it takes is a spark to start a serious fire. The relative humidity is very, very low. With the fuels already dried out, it only takes a cigarette uh, flicked out of a, a moving vehicle or maybe even a hot vehicle pulling off the side of the road into this dense underbrush that can create a fire. They also have five air tanker units helping out, hoping to protect the structures at risk. And at this point, there is no word as to the cause of the fire. That is still under investigation. We're live in Green Valley. Max Darrow, KGON 9, on your side.